Welcome back to Arena 254. I'm sure that your Saturday is absolutely fantastic. And of course, this is the time of the show when we get you closer to all your favorite celebrities. And this next young lady has started off on YouTube. She's gone on to do radio. She's hilarious AF. I think I'm allowed to say you that at this I'm time funny. of the day. But it is the one, the only Rono. <laughs> you think so funny? Hi. I'm so happy to yeah. be here. At least I'm the, like one of, at least now I'm with him. Because yeah. like one dark skin. Well, I, yeah, I yeah, feel yeah, like we're like like in different like worlds. Yeah, she's in, she's in <laughs> her I own world. Was, I thought she was just being a fan. I'm like, oh, this is about skin color too. <laughs> Welcome to Arena. Thank you. I'm so excited to be here, man. Yeah? I follow you on Instagram. Really? But you don't follow me. It's okay. <laughs> okay. No, it's no, okay. No. I do really, do you really follow me? I do, me? I do. Really? Hey, you're I shouting. You, man. <laughs> oh my God. Is this going to turn about your Instagram <laughs> following and, no, and but following? I'm such a fan. I literally do. I love you so much Guys, and I'm so me, excited. Let me tell you something about Rono, right? Mm. So yesterday I was at work. Yeah. yeah. My other work. And one of my colleagues called Maureen is such a huge fan yeah. of Rono. So I was like, let me call up Rono. And you never actually talked, right? No, we've never. And she was so gracious and you're like, let me talk to her. And you had Quite like you a moment me to, with okay, her. Did you want me to be like, Bombay are chill? No, I just thought it was so cool. I'm like, you're so down to earth. You're yeah. so chill. But there's and nothing I loved to be, it. There's nothing to brag about. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I, don't, I don't think you really understand how yeah. huge Rono, the name Rono is. Oh, it there. is? Yeah. Uh, I wish the money could reflect. Let's, let's get, let's get <laughs> into it. I, I, I think my director has a couple of videos we'll be playing mm. um, in between. Mm -hmm. um, but let's start off with how you came into the scene, into the limelight. You guys have like two biscuits. Yeah. Right? Even juice. <laughs> 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 a story. Anyway, like in, um, yeah. You've asked me how I started off. Yeah, how you started off. I basically started like when I was in high school. Mm -hmm. uh, that's 2017. I was like in Wait, 20, what? 2017. Not sure. Wait. But like I finished last year. Uh, you I you finished high school last year. I finished high school. <laughs> No, like you're joking, right? Uh, like this is part of your act. No, the, I finished high school last year. I started in Form 3. Uh, like I started making videos in Form 3 and then things started happening in Form 4. All right. Yeah. Did I still confuse you? She's like, hey. I'm like, she finished high school last <laughs> year. Like 20, but I'm still taking your months. Are you yeah. <laughs> It's 2018. No, no. I that kind of show. I'm sorry, but I, I finished last year. Yeah. And then I... I just this year I've just been around like right. I haven't decided to go to school. Anything. And is it something you knew like you'd get into? Because no. I feel like your YouTube is one of the few that has really grown and mm. really fast. Some people take a while, like a year or two, to really catch on to it. Mm -hmm. But off the bat, people are like, we need to know this girl. Mm. We need to watch her yeah. videos, and they're so rel relatable. relatable. Yeah. I, I guess like. <sighs> I didn't think I would even like. I actually didn't think I'd be in this space. I thought I'd be like a doctor. <laughs> <laughs> is, that what, is that what you wanted to be? Yeah, imagine I wanted to be a doctor. What sort of doctor? Uh, I just I didn't know. I just wanted to be a, as long as I was a doctor. I just uh -huh. wanted to do medicine or something. Yeah. Then I wanted to be like a vet. Uh -huh. okay, I had dreams, and then I just realized like I used to tell stories to people and they'd laugh or like people like, I'd just sit down people in high school and uh -huh. to check it and they're like you know what do something about it so then I started and then yeah like right. YouTube is doing great I guess and I'm just I just I'm myself you'll never see me in makeup only today because I'm on TV guys yeah. my guys <laughs> now as you wake awake I'm living not through shade I'm up close but okay, all yeah. right. <laughs> and so when it comes so right now when you're done with high school yeah are you studying anything in relation to your communication I'm going to do a mass comm in Desta, yeah. <laughs> but then it's, I don't want to go to school anytime soon because it's like really hectic right now. Yeah. It's because at a point where it's, it's hard even to like, I don't think I can do evening classes and balance. Mm -hmm. So I, He's in Desta. Yeah. And he, he's actually, you've gone back, really? I've gone back yeah. for masters. Yeah. So he did his master in master. day side and now he's yeah. doing his And, and I was working while doing my undergrad. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> so I was doing my master's. Like, you know, I just got an into big bro. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just like, like little girl, but go then, to school. <laughs> I will, I will. I am, I am this year. Yeah, I, will, I, I know you will. I will eventually. go to school. I have been teasing it for like the longest time, but I will go to school and do like probably mass communication, which is in line with what I'm doing. So it's not us. What did you do? I did mass comm. Uh, then when I start, is it trash? By the way, am I going to waste no, my time? No. <laughs> the thing is, <laughs> it's good. It's good for your. It's good for yeah. your. It's good for your theory parts mm -hmm. in terms because I did electronic media, uh -huh. so it's good for your theory parts. 
So you said... Zero 07? I will check. <laughs> can you check his number? But so it's Rana, really, Rana came it's with really, a squad. Really she has a, a squad. Eh? So when you see her pointing to someone, it's her gang gang. No. But <laughs> if you guys are wondering, if you haven't seen Rono in action, mm. here are a couple of videos that we are going to watch and you should get to see as well um, so that we can you can really understand oh. what she does, the beauty. Yeah. Are they going to be on that screen? Yeah. Yeah. To be honest, I feel like it's not just me. Who your mama are? Insufficient balance. Who shouts? I mean, you are shouting. Madam, it's me and you. It's one on one. Why embarrass me? I know I don't have the money. But you must shout. Nana Penanga says, Ile muna fanya conference call muma yaka watu loudspeaker. Ndo anasema, You have insufficient balance. So? Guys, let me just top up. Give me five minutes, I top. I mean, you already embarrassed me. I'm embarrassed. Press one to okoa jahazi. Sorry, you already okoa. Nambona nikiwa na credit amusha utingi. You are sufficient. Get out of here, man. Yeah, oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> Another one. <laughs> so that's Rano in her true, true elements. And I like how, like, when you're watching it's so yourself. It's so cringy. I can't, do I don't you watch. watch yourself? No. So, like, when people are talking Would you about, rewatch yourself if you talk like that? I also find it very weird to, like, just watch yourself. Yeah, watching it's very, it, I feel like it's, it's another level of vanity. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, oh, look at me. Wow. But you know, I the, look good. The beauty <laughs> about what you do, Rono, yeah. is we are so used to the the old kind of comedians, mm -hmm. you know? And that's a chill show stand, you know? Tell us oh, a joke, check, check it, you know? Jokes. I love to kungo je next uh, Sunday. Um, and this is a whole new vibe. Like, you're using new media, new social mm -hmm. ways of interacting with people. So how did you break through th into that? Because I feel like a lot of com old comedians are mm -hmm. finding it Sorry, hot minute. Can the guy, can you like zoom into these edges? Because I've put some <laughs> effort, my guy. I mean, when you're doing the up close. <laughs> and that is Ronald. <laughs> no, for it, like, continue. Yeah. Yeah. Um, do you, have you, how, uh, what do you think about comedians, older comedians yes. who are finding it hard to break the barrier into this kind of new media? Hey, Mataka, don't get it. You want to speak trash? No, no. no just say honesty. Uh, and all, yeah. Okay, the thing is, uh, how do I explain it? I yeah. feel like, there's this new era mm -hmm. like people have come up with so many ideas mm -hmm. of how to like throw their personality out there you know kitambo you have to pass through mm -hmm. that kashol you know yeah. that show on that station yeah so that you're able to like be known and stuff like that but now it's because a point guys are using the platforms they have yeah. to push that i'm this and this so i kind of didn't want to be like kenyanized mm -hmm. i don't know how to explain that to you i didn't want to be like i have to be tribalistic with my mm -hmm. jokes or i have to be this and this i just said i'll throw a personality i won't say i'm a comedian mm -hmm. i just throw out a personality that i feel like is appealing and entertaining mm -hmm. and i went with it yeah. so it's figured a point where i feel like the other comedians are trying to also push their personality into the yeah. you know because they most of the time you know speaking from a performer kind of mm -hmm. uh, point of view uh -huh. most of the comedians are like, i'm a performer mm -hmm. i'm here to entertain mm -hmm. but then it becomes different when i you're through you're selling a personality like this is me mm -hmm. i do this like just look Take at me yeah, as I am. Yeah. yeah yeah awesome and, and when i know you were in dubs what just two weeks a week um, ago actually <laughs> Yeah, thank you. I was going to say that. Dubai. Uh, <laughs> no, guys, dubs. For well, people who are not dubs, I'll help you arrange it. It's Dubai, Dubai. not Dubai. Yeah. But, um, <laughs> I was in Dubai, my guys. Uh, I feel like I went for like four days, but we yeah. piga kelele. You gotta know, you gotta know. But it was really nice. Yeah. Yeah. What are you asking? Like, did I get yes. some hands? Yeah, yeah. In fact, yeah. I was gonna ask if you went and you got an hey, Arab, Arab guy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just joking. My mom is watching. I'm, she knows has found his match on the no, show. No, it's a dish. Yeah. Oh, it's a dish. <laughs> yeah. Reasons, wow. So the reason you are in Dubai is because you you work for. Uh, local radio station mm -hmm. called I NRG. If I right? mention, oh. No, it's fine. Like, um, they're cool people, yeah, let's cool personalities, mm -hmm. right? And they had they had a partnership with Emirates, yeah? And we had Sean Freezy here the other day, if you guys remember, and he talks about it. So you Did he from... you? Huh? Did Sean? Alas. You are lucky. No, no, these are discussions we should be having. <laughs> <I> was... <laughs> off air, you no, know? No, 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 no. I feel like... <laughs> As I feel like I need to hear this conversation. Yeah. You were saying? Uh -huh. You were saying? Sean, you were talking about selfies. You were saying, selfies are going to be a little bit. You just saw, you were saying, selfies are going to be a little bit. But the main question is... No, 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 no. She said, you were saying, 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 
Let me tell you. Ah, will you check engine? I mean, my, my chest. Yeah. Did you Let check me, that engine? What did you make it I feel like you've confessed yeah. something here. No, 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 no. And you've never had the drop. I don't think you listen to radio enough. In a kwanga, chukua selfie. I, you I, I know it. Equals. I do ask for chukua selfie on radio. You're Mbele at Tujui Kwa. No, 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 no. But that chukua selfie, when we're talking about Mbele Iko Sawa, it is that Mbele. Chito is going to have a conversation that none of us want to have. So, so we go no, back. she's the one who opened the door. It's just like she smashed the door and she's like, Sean, take this one. Yeah, yeah, so me, and Mike him. Someone, <laughs> him up, yeah? And Mike this guy. Going back to the Dubai Dubai conversation, right? Mm. The reason you are on that is because you you came what? from you got an amazing opportunity yeah, to be a radio a radio personality. Actually, people want to hear me talk. Right? Like, okay. Did, I, so I, tell I, us how, how were you called? Did, did there are people call your people? It's a long story. What what happened? It's a long story. So yeah. I do a show that used to be done by uh, also con another content creator and stuff like that. Uh -huh. So there was a it was like a Saturday show and it was vacant. Mm -hmm. So then I said, let me apply for it because I was like, I think they might want some of my juice, uh -huh. you know, some of my mocha hookah. Uh -huh. So I, <laughs> so I applied for it, and at first it was hard because like they really made me feel like, yeah, when in army. Yeah. <laughs> but then I, I luckily I got it because at the time it was a show about content creation, mm -hmm. so they thought I had I know the plot and everything. Mm -hmm. Got onto the show, we worked hard, and then we were moved to a mid morning show. Yeah. So. Catch me no, from do, you want, do, you want, do you want to know something very interesting? Mm. So you do this show every single Saturday with Charlie no, Karumi. No, no, no. I, we were moved to a mid yeah. show, yeah. Um, so now you're doing it to Charlie, still, still Charlie Karumi. Charlie, yeah. So Charlie used to be a host on Arena 254. I don't know if you knew that. <laughs> yeah. The OG on this show. So <laughs> I mean, I'm walking everywhere you're going, Charlie. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> so hi, Charlie. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And so how, how has that shift been? Because I know on, on YouTube, yeah. it's more about you and your camera and, and you just sending oh, yeah, the personality. Baby. But now on radio, it's like millions of people are, to, are listening to you. And come on, if it's iteration, you're getting it firsthand. Yeah. Huh? I feel like radio is way harder than TV. Would you do radio or TV? I do he radio. Does I both. work on radio. I work for Kiss FM. I have a show called The Maloko Show. Una shout! <laughs> but, <laughs> but I personally feel like... Um, radio is harder because yeah, I'm used TV, to TV. Yeah, radio is. Because um, radio, you have to sell personality. You have to it's sell a person completely. You look, you know? Your everyday matters. Yeah. Everything you do, people care. Everything you say, people care. So with time, it's like <laughs> topics in Asia. Because <laughs> every day you're giving a little bit of your day, or every day you're giving, uh, you have to do some little research and like talk about things. Yeah. So it's been, I thought it was going to be easy, but it's not really that easy. But it's really thrilling. Mm -hmm. There's this vibe. Have you, do you not get this thing when you're just live? It, there's, it's a difference. It's a different. You it's can a, it's like, the it's whole like an link. ecstasy. Yeah. It's, can, an it's, a, it's an ecstasy. Exactly. You can mm. panga the whole link. You enter, you, you cast and your everything life just away. Goes. Yeah. <laughs> so and Arrhenians, I just want to reiterate this again. This mm. Ronald just finished high school oh, last year. Oh, they're called Yeah, okay. Arrhenians. <laughs> <laughs> okay. okay. All right. All right. So just finished high school last year. Mm -hmm. um, you haven't had any training in, in content creation, in media. So you're doing this off the bat. You're off getting... So you can live out your dream. If their people are not calling your people, call their people. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know, that's what she's telling us. Mm. Go for your dreams and, mm. and have fun with it. Yeah. Yeah. And so, like, is this something you want to do for the rest of your life? My guys, come on a letter, Pasa. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just joking. But I found this thrill. Uh -huh. like, I found this thrill in just content creation and making people happy. And when people approach me, they're like, "Yo, you're that, you're that fat girl." I'm like, "Yeah." But you're shouting the fat part, you know. <laughs> but like every every single time I meet someone and tell me you made my day or like you made me happy, I feel like that's my inspiration. I feel like that's why I'm doing it. I just yeah. like this. I just like it. It's like a thrill, and yeah. you get better, and you get you to understand people more, and you relate with people more. It's, it's yeah. interesting. I like the part you just mentioned about money. I feel like you know sometimes our parents are just mm. looking at us wondering, I you? you're making on YouTube, Instagram, matter to join Nini, you're just talking, you What's know, up? and people are laughing. Sharon, are you're you looking into that money? camera very yeah? strongly. Are you, are are you, you sending a message money? to your you mother? <laughs> <laughs> uh, so tell us about that bit and be as real as you as you can be. Mm -hmm. Um how how is the money? How what's it looking like on this side? What I always say is the money reflects to the much you put in mm -hmm. and how you do it. And you see the thing is like how do I explain this to you? Uh it's just as long as you know what you want mm -hmm. and you know the minute you work so hard on your craft mm -hmm. and you build it to a position where you can sell it. And then you know what you want, you know what kind of companies I want to approach, I know what I want to do. Mm -hmm. If it's in terms of endorsements, I'm not just throwing a product in your face, yeah. you know. The minute you know, like, this is what I want and this is what I can do, I can earn money via this and this and this, you work on the angle on which, first of all, you work on the angle of which you can get cash. Mm -hmm. You see, if it's like, probably content creation, if it's, um, 
I don't know. Like you just figure out this craft. Mm -hmm. How Has can to, I? How, how yeah? Plan. How can I yeah. extract cash from it? So the money part is quite um, yeah. And I, I know we were having like a funny conversation before we started off, and mm. you were asking about my embarrassing moments. And I was telling, I was telling her that I've almost fallen on, on set. I've, I've said my, my Owekoyo has come out very strongly mm. a couple of Mashema, times. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Have you had any embarrassing moments um, during this oh, yeah. stint on, on radio? Of course. Yeah. <laughs> and maybe give us like an example of it. Let me tell you. I think my first show, uh, we were covering up. So we were those guys for, you know, those, you, you know your daughter did your presenter, you're told, oh, you you are on a weekend show, uh. sour. You know, it, it feels like you don't belong, you know? Yeah. So we were thrown into a night show. My friend, my friend, I really, I said some things. Uh. You know, the thing is, I panicked. Mm -hmm. So when I panicked, I said things that CAK don't Vulgar allow. language? Right. I, it was like so many. <laughs> I was like, fuck. Uh. I was all out. Uh. And then the guy just switched off my mic. That was Charlie. Now he just switched off my mic and looked at me. <laughs> and he was like, Ume bant, <laughs> ume bant. But then that was, the, I feel like that's my most embarrassing moment. Yeah. And also like not knowing what to say. You know, yeah. as a radio presenter, you can't keep quiet. See like TV at least, tunaza angaliana, tuangale camera, tufanye kapoz, <laughs> tuseme, by the, um, you ni need, uh, you know. In radio, if you don't know what you're saying, you don't know what you're saying. Yeah. You know? Wow. And what about the boys? Are they more now? If you want to know, I mean, <laughs> like it to my no. DM. in terms of what do you mean? In hey, look at you, try look at you. You're, 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 you're not gonna, like you're not, you're not gonna <laughs> screw, screw this conversation. To know. It's <laughs> not in terms of friendship. Uh -huh. so Are you calls, is your, your DMs, DMs must be full. No, actually, let me tell you the truth of the matter. Uh -huh. People are so intimidated by me. I do not know why. Uh -huh. I don't know why. I think it's <laughs> maybe they think you're, gonna, you're okay? gonna make a skit out of them. <laughs> So many guys tell me like, hey, we're not going to be able to do it. Guys, let's just, let's just give incentive right now. Mm. You can DM her. You can call yeah, her. You are, can text her. We are open. We are open. 24-7. We are, open. Are. 24 yeah. we are yeah. What is the progi? Tell mm. us. What's oh happening? You know? You, 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 <laughs> you write, when you slide into my DM, don't bring me jokes. You write your name, uh -huh. your bank account statement. And no saxa <laughs> and hi. You know, you know those Your things. balance. Yes. Before we can proceed into the accepting request. I mean... I nobody got time for me. You. you know, right now, no one in the room wants to know your favorite color. Uh -huh. <laughs> Do you think someone is going to sit down? Oh, the way that looks. At, how many siblings? I, my friend, unani pia moni you go. What do you mean? It's a hard life you are living in. I and think. guys, that is Rono. Gosh. I freaking love you. Thank I you so much man. for coming through, Anarina. Yes, I feel like we should have you. Eh? In my band. Eh, ume, 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 here for how long? <laughs> I've been here for a hot minute. For, for a while, eh? Okay. Eh, I think okay. we have we have loved ume, 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 quite a lot mm. that we did know. <laughs> But I just want to say thank you so much for coming through. I think Welcome. Iranians, if you are taking if you are taking notes, like I've learned so much. Go to where the dream is, run for it, work hard for it, you know. And don't limit yourself to age or or whatever you 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 are studying or if you feel like you even need to study. Like I hope you are taking notes, guys. But if you want to get more from Rono, obviously you know she's big on social. Where can we find you? Uh, okay. So Instagram is at Rono .h. Uh -huh. This is what you do for everyone. Everyone. Do they? Do you know what they do? They do. Okay, okay. Arabians are loyal. I don't know the on Instagram and then on YouTube is Great Day Channel. Great Day Channel. Yeah. So she's going to be talking to you. The conversation doesn't have to end here. Make sure you are talking to her. And of course, I am bringing you closer to your star. So much more coming through. Make sure you're texting me 21222 or email feedback at mediamax.co.k. I'm Sharon Kenganga at arena underscore 54 everywhere. I'm coming back with some really, really cool people so you don't want to miss this and Slim is coming through with music as well so see you after this.